Hey Summoners! Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have some exciting updates for you from Tower of Saviors. Let's dive into the latest news, including new characters, events, and challenges you won't want to miss. First up, we have the brand new, Wrathful Horizon, Diamond Seal series characters. After the scheduled maintenance on July 15th, a new drawing machine called, Warring Cries, will be available. You can summon 6 new characters from this series, featuring exclusive team skills for Gladiospina and Fantokata members. The details of Diamond Seal Drawing Machine. Be alert that there will be 3 chance up events for this Diamond Seal Drawing Machine. The first event will be held from the 23rd of July to the 25th of July, and the second event will be held from the 5th of August to the 7th of August while the last event will be held from the 6th of September to the 8th of September. The chance of getting the rare characters of the Wrathful Horizon series will be boosted during the events. Let's break down the exclusive team skills for Gladiospina and Fantokata in the series as well. Team skill for Gladiospina. Team skill for Fantokata. Leader skill. Team skill. Active skill 1. Active skill 2. Active skill 1 fixed board. Bonding skill. Leader skill. Team skill. Active skill. Bonding skill. Gram active skill 1. Gram active skill 2. Gram bonding skill. Tearfing active skill 1. Tearfing active skill 2. Tearfing bonding skill. Adma effect skill 1. Adma effect skill 2. Adma bonding skill. Zor active skill. Zor bonding skill. Next, summoners can get the exclusive Dragonware, Paradoxical Legacy, for Wrathful Horizon, Diamond Seal series by completing specific missions in the Tower of Saviors Fest Mission Award event. This DW offer extends moving time, skill cooldown and extra damage.
Starting the 15th of July, Mon, a new calamitous stage, a game of conquest, will be available in the Lost Relic. Those who clear the calamitous stage will be rewarded with a 3-star blank card to unlock a 3-star Cronin card. At the same time 3 new Cronin cards will be added to the game after the scheduled maintenance. Let's dive into these 3 new Cronin cards. The details of the calamitous stage, a game of conquest. At the same time, the previous chronographic calamitous stage will be returned during the Tower of Saviors Fest events. Please take note of each calamitous stage restriction and wave skill before challenging the stage. Three Star Chronographic Card One star chronographic card. One star chronographic card. Next, don't miss the new challenge stage Fortune Favors the Bold. By clearing this stage, you can get the new Light Demon character Temptation of Wealth, Napoleon. Details of Challenge Stage Napoleon Team Skill Napoleon Active Skill Moreover, new Battle Pass event. During the Battle Pass event, earn Express to level up your pass and get rewards like Steel of God X10 and Dodo. For even more rewards, you can unlock the Battle Pass Premium for items like Dual Max Dodo, new Icon Frames, and exclusive Dragonware. Dodo Team Skill Dodo Active Skill Premium Rewards The DW offers skill cooldown, two different extra damage which one of them deal extra damage to demon enemy. This DW also limited to Dark Beast member only. Last but not least, we have new bi-weekly stage after maintenance. Avander Active Skill That's all for this today's video. On the next video, we will look at the details on Tower of Saviors Fest events and information updates. Don't forget to look at this. Let me know in the comments which new character you're most excited about. Thank you for watching. See you in the game.